everybody, my name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play on Original Craft Season 2. Ooh, I should probably start saying that, because it is Season 2 and all. So on the last episode, <laughs> I essentially showed off spawn, and then I spent the rest of the episode looking for a cave and exploring the great lands and seeing many beautiful lands. But alas, there was no cave. No cave. <sighs> I'd say, I'm sorry, I'm burpy for some reason all of a sudden. I, I don't freaking know. Um... Yeah, at the very end of the episode, I found this freaking abandoned mine shaft, and I'm scared. You know what? Let's let's go ahead and just let's just do this now. Let's just let's just admire the beauty. Great. How's that skeleton comes to murder my face? Come on, skeleton! Don't you dare! I know you could. I know you're gonna want to shoot me, but you can't. I won't let you. I won't let you. All right. I'm okay with this now. Do it! Do it! Oh! Oh, good lord! Uh, ah! You blow up, it's okay, guy. Ah! <laughs> All three of them were starting to go. That was scary, man. He was scaring me. Oh. Don't really, can't really say I enjoy that. Oh, it's right there. Great. It just, you can be gone. Oh, I turned to a pink spider. <laughs> I think that spider got swept away by the current. Oh, there he is. Alright, let's try to keep... Uh, I think the current will take care of him, yeah. Oh, it didn't take care of him at all! Crap! I don't like spiders. <laughs> not in real life, and not in the gaming lives. Hey, the bow survived somehow. Oh, oh, oh. Those regular spiders. I hear another skeleton as well. Skeleton moose. He's on the loose. Gotta be very careful. Oh man, it's lagging a bit. So I've had a really bad day today. <laughs> uh, um, have I updated you guys on my car? I I don't know if I have talked about that yet or not. Um, well, I went to do an oil change on my car, and I said, hey, uh, since I work at a place that works on cars, I should probably do a checkup on my car and see if there's anything wrong with it. And one of the guys I actually work with. It's like, yeah, I never like checking up on my car. I'm like, why? He's like, Cause I don't even want to know what's wrong with it. I'm like, that's stupid. And then I checked out the car, and then it turns out I need an over $1,000 repair on it. So then I was like, I see what you mean now. <laughs> so I had to do it because, um, well, actually, it's not it's not actually my car. It's my mom's car. And she made a deal with me essentially being, if I pay for this repair, it's my car. So I was like, okay. I mean, ooh. Ooh. Ooh, okay, you see me. Now I must kill you. I must kill you. I've never... Why don't you guys have sound effects yet? I don't understand. Alright, you're dead. Did you... Okay, I was going to say, do they even drop experience? I'm... I don't know much about witches. So, I think it's almost like $1,200, actually. And I decided to make the repair instead of just saying, No, it's your car, Mom. You have it back. For one... I would feel really bad because I have driven that car way more than she has since she she got it because she actually she had to move away for business related reasons um, temporarily but she she's she hasn't been she, she moved relatively soon after she got the car and then she left it here because she didn't have a reason to take it with her because she had other modes of transportation so I've been pretty much driving it along and I mean like I said I would have felt really freaking bad <laughs> If, um, I was like, okay, mom, your car doesn't work anymore. I'm done with it. You can pay for it. Whatever. I don't care. So I, I knew I, at least I should pay for it. So I actually made a deal with her. Or I offered her a deal, I should say. That, um, it, since it's her car, I was like, well, how about this? I pay two-thirds of the repair and you pay one-third. And then, um, instead, she counter-offered me with, how about this? It's your car if you pay for it. <laughs> So, yeah, $1,200 is quite a bit, but, um, the reason why I'm deciding mostly, because I could pay it off in, like, increments as little as I want, and I guess you can do that with loans as well, but it's a lot more complicated and screwy, and I don't really like dealing with that kind of stuff, because I'm not very good at knowing how to deal with that kind of stuff. Holy crap, there's a lot of iron. I, I'm getting away from the, um, mine shaft. I didn't, I wanted to be in that mine shaft. I'm probably gonna die, but <laughs> YOLO, am I right? <laughs> Sorry. 
How much coal do I have? I have a lot of freaking coal. Okay, great. Okay, great. I'm going to start getting rid of a bunch of crap in a second as well. I'll stop collecting coal for now. I don't really need it. I'm sure I'll get tons of it eventually one day when I do another strip mine like I did last season. But I was seriously, I like... I spent maybe three or four days on that strip mine, and that was enough to keep me going for the entire season. So keep that. Keep in mind, there was a few months on the on the server that I wasn't on at all due to like work and stuff. But like like for the most part, it was able to keep me going for a very long time. So I'll probably just make a um, my own little mine shaft eventually. But yeah, so it's going to cost $1,200 to get the car repaired. But in the meantime, it's actually been in the shop for a few days now. Actually, I didn't even explain what was wrong with it. Um, when I was doing an oil change... Oh, good lord! Holy crap! When I was doing an oil change, I checked the coolant levels, which keeps the engine cool. I believe that's all it does, right? I'm, I'm not actually 100% sure. And, um... Oh, I'm going to go ahead and fix that now before I die. What just happened? Did you guys see that? Is it gone? What? It's gone. What? 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 What do I have cooked mutton? Oh, it's back now. Oh, oh my god. Hmm, I, I realize Randy's talking to me, but I, I record episode. I, I told him I was recording Randy. Jeez. I'm just kidding. I'm not really mad. I'm going to kill you, Randy. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to murder you. I'm going to stab you and your joinkies. I don't know what a joinkie is, but when I find out, I will kill you with them. Or hit you in them. Or I, I, whatever. So, yeah, there, there's oil in my coolant. <laughs> Essentially meaning that should that oil that leak is leaking into my coolant should that go through my engine and stuff it would kill it and it would just be a dead board or a dead car um so yeah i decided to fix it because i wasn't really ready to go car hunting it was scary 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 times to me and i want to go back to this mine shaft let's go back to this mine shaft keep saying that but i keep saying see more caves i'm like ooh, i wonder what's down there there's nothing down there chris nothing Nothing but misery and failure, just like it's that's gonna be down here as well. But I mean, at least it'll be more entertaining, maybe. Probably not. So, um, I've been driving the truck in the meantime, which the truck, uh, it's not very good as well. <laughs> it's also a vehicle that's on its last leg. Um, there's a lot wrong with it, there's a lot of leaks in it, and it would seriously cost thousands upon thousands of dollars repaired. So, that's a definite no go. So, I've been driving for the past few days. And, um, this is the part where it gets stupid. Uh, where we park in my yard, there's actually, we have like a cement pad. There's gotta be more of this mine shaft than this. And, uh, there's actually rhubarb sticking out of this pad in two spots. Where two of the gates we have on this pad meet. And, if, unfortunately, you have to drive around these rhubarb posts in order to park it. And I've been actually pretty lucky I haven't hit it in the past, like, three or four months I've been parking there. Although I have had help since the snow. I've been using the snow to pad down where the rhubarb was, so I didn't really have to worry about hitting it ever. But um, the day came today with the truck that I ran it over, and it not only, like, put a hole in the tire, but it put a hole in the tire to the point where it's unfixable. So that's another $100, and we do have a spare tire. Is that it's deadly poisonous spider? No, it is not. We do have like a... Uh, oh boy. There's a lot of bad things. Oh, that's a bat. Okay, I thought that was a baby spider, but it's not a baby spider. Oh, good lord. Are you going to blow up? Yeah, this, this, I don't like this leg very much. It's not very nice to me. What's that? Oh, there's lava above me. Interesting. Very interesting. It would be in Whoa! Holy crap. It'd be very unfortunate if a creeper is going to blow up. Don't blow up. I don't actually want you to blow up, Mr. Dude. Seriously? Come on. Just die. Thank you. Oh, why is there so many? Is there a creeper spawner? Ah! There we go. Okay. I was going to say, you know what? You can blow up. Kill all the things. You know? 
What does what more? There's more you whore? Oh, he's stuck in the webbing. Ha ha! You're doomed. There's another one? Oh, he's over there. Get over here. Yeah, booger. There we go. So the spare we have for the chuck is um it was flat ever since I first ever since we got the chuck up and running again. Which is about two years ago. It's been flat, and I was always worried to put air in it because the rim is so rusted. It's like, holy crap, I don't even understand. But I actually put air to it, and holy crap, it's actually holding air. And I don't know if it'll actually be holding air in the morning when I have to go to work. I'll probably check it before I go to bed to make sure it's all good and dandy and stuff. I've got to pause here in a second to get more torches. I don't know why I'm saying everything with a weird accent like that. Ah! Wow, what the? Ah, so dumb. Freaking legs, <laughs> but uh, I was actually really shocked to hold held air at all. So I thought for sure I was gonna have to either bus or take a taxi to work. Which oh my good lord, it would not have been fun, especially because of my broken toe right now. Because all I've been doing at work has just been sitting there, not doing much of anything. The other two days I've worked, I've been filing stuff and calling people, and you know trying to be a salesman type guy, which I'm not very good at, to be honest. <laughs> Um, oh, I thought that was diamond for some reason. No, it's one of the new stones. Diorite? Is that what that one is? But, um, yeah, so I'm really thankful that the spare is holding air, and it took forever to get it up and working on the truck. The limited supplies I had. I was actually pretty proud of myself for getting it working. Um, yeah, so... I was very, very, very careful because I did park the truck uh, where, you know, past the spot where I like ran over the rhubarb and killed the tire, murdered that tire. I need more torches. I need a lot more torches. Can you give me more torches? Thank you. I would enjoy it to have more torches. I made too many sticks. Oh, well, I'm a yellow swig. I don't know why I'm saying yellow swig for it. It's really stupid. I got to stop. Uh, what do I care about? I don't care about seeds. I want to find a treasure chest. Where is a treasure chest? So yeah, I'm really hoping that that works out well. I just really want the spare tire to last till the car gets fixed, which I'm hoping will be in a, f it'll probably be in a half a week's time. So if the spare tire can last till that, that'd be amazing. I'm gonna drive it as little as possible, and pray to the almighty spare tire heavens that it all works out. Why? And how come are you are no breaking things? I mean, he broke two blocks. whoop de do. Oh, no. Are we getting mob leg? <gasps> oh, good lord. I need to kill you quick, and I need to kill you quick. Quick, 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 like a bunny. Now we gotta go over here, and then we gotta go over there. Eh. Eh. Great. Now we gotta kill you. Yeah. Why aren't you... Why are you guys not scared of me? Why are you guys not trying to eat my face? Hey, it's a skeleton! <laughs> I think there's another one in there. Or is that just a bow? Oh, great. More of my leg. No, I keep expecting. You know, I should just break this. There. Oh, there. I did just break it. God dang it. Freaking legs. Hello. Hello. Alright. You must die and stuff. Oh, good lord. Ooh, is this a ravine? Ooh, more poisonous spiders. Great. My favorite. Just kidding. It's not my favorite. It's my least favorite. Let's place a torch down so you guys can see better. See, I'm right there with a freaking butthead. These butthead assholes. Alright. <sighs> so, yeah, that's my life story right now. And I gotta say, trying to change out a spare tire with a broken or fractured toe is not very fun. What do we got here? Power 2. That's pretty nice. I'll take it. Should I go down here? Why not? Just do it. Just yellow swaggles. I have yet to find. Oh, good lord! Ah, eh, 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 eh. Oh boy, how long is this gonna last? Nine seconds. Start eating so I can start healing. I'm always a little bit worried about the possibility of a mob coming to kill me. Whoa, what? You guys see that? My inventory screen just moved. Ah. I hear bad guys. Okay, that's just a normal spider. Every time I see a spider, it kind of scares me. It kind of makes me pee a little bit. Am I even low enough for diamonds? Where am I? 36. I am not low enough for diamonds, so this ravine is pointless to me. I really want to find diamonds, guys. <laughs> Ooh. 
Uh, let's not pull a UHC season three. You know where I fell off the cliff? Yeah. Did I die? You may be asking. Well, go watch and find out. <laughs> I died. <laughs> uh, I wasn't gonna actually spoil it there, but well, too late. Yep. A stupid death. Surprise, surprise. Echoes alive. If anyone knows that reference, I would be freaking shocked, and I would call you a liar, and I would say you did a bunch of research, because you don't know that reference. There's no freaking way. No one is as nerdy as me in that regard. Oh, good lord, what the balls, man? You freaking gold-ass butter. Get your gold-ass butter out of here. Why you guys keep scaring me, huh? Suckers? Brothers? Uh, okay, I guess that just ends there. Great, fantastic. Uh, never have been so happy in my life. Just kidding, I'm pretty sad about it, actually. Does this just dead end? Yes, it does. Wow, great mind trap, guys. Wow. <sighs> Why doesn't it go down farther? Whoa, got a bit of a leg there. Just one single leg. Not many legs, just one single leg. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> I haven't seen any chests yet. I'm wondering, do the chest, do the items you get in the chests in mine shafts, are they also dependent on the Y level you're on? Like, will I not find a diamond in a chest in a mine shaft if I'm not in like you know below minus thirty or something? It'd be a bit weird to be honest. Hey, speaking of chests, oh great, garbage, great. Wow. Wow. I don't think I have pumpkins that spawn. Should I take those pumpkin seeds? Let's take those pumpkin seeds. I don't know, I care. I don't why do I why? Why do I have wool? <laughs> 39 string? Oh, I guess that makes sense actually with all the mine shaft crap. I care about the leather, the dirt. The dirt. The derp. Hello again. Don't know what I'm doing this voice for. Great, did you see that magic floating flying skeleton? It was pretty fr oh no. God dang it. It's like, I'm gonna break that chest, so I don't have to worry about walking back again. Well, you're stupid, Chris, you're stupid. <laughs> don't forget that you're stupid. <laughs> I'm not sorry, I'm gonna say hi in a moment. Don't worry, your pretty little head's off. L L O. Uh oh, something's happened. Some bad has happened. Uh oh. Uh oh. You found out about my uh, devilish plan to um, entrap him in. Um, uh, yeah, I got nothing. <laughs> uh, -da -da. I hear bad things. Very bad things. This mine shaft doesn't really seem that large. Hey, Skellington, I don't. I'm scratching my nose. Don't attack me. I'd give me the, what a good guy. I mean, he didn't. Oh, great. There's another one. Uh, enchanted bow. Why are you walking? Why are you hiding? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I don't want to kill you. He didn't want to fight. He was a peace skeleton. I'm sorry. Oh, man. Oh, it's, is there a spawner in here? Hello? Uh, of course there is. Of course there is. Of course it's a horse. Eh. Eh, eh. I hate you guys. Just, just want to let you know. Oh, it's a bat. Why am I even doing this? Why am I even doing this, man? Oh man, I haven't found a single diamond yet. That's normally how it goes for me. I don't find diamonds for years, and I don't know why I'm talking this weird accent. Is this even an accent? Probably not. What Y level are we on now? 38. Great, we're going up. We've made negative progress since I checked last. Hey, we're going down a level. Okay, so it looks like I got my wish. This thing has been expanded a little bit more. Um, what else can I talk about? Anything else interested happen in my life? I can't reply, Matt. I'm busy recording. I can't. I'm sorry. Oh, no! I made a terrible mistake! Okay, I figured that would happen. Um, if we go down here, is there anything? Doesn't. Well, looks like there's a secret, secret, secret. 
And also, why do I even have a shovel? I mean, I haven't used it once. I don't normally even use shovels. Also, I'm digging out a lot of God dang it. I don't like this block leg. Don't know why it's an issue. I upgraded the server. Should I be doing this? <sighs> Whoa. I almost left that guy alone. Let's just let him do his thing. <laughs> Go on living. I place torch in you, which destroys water for some reason. I don't freaking understand how this game works. Hey, it's Lapis Lululus. Come on, getting there. My face is itchy again. Why am I so itchy? I don't understand. I see a skeleton or a uh, creeper up there. Should probably make myself an iron sword in a second here. That could have ended badly. Um, yeah, let's grab some of this. We're gonna need it. We're gonna need it for enchanting, apparently. That's just how the enchanting table's gonna go. Alright, so I've actually started making a list of things, of stories, of memories I have collected throughout my childrenhoods. And, um, I'm gonna try not to do repeat stories anymore. I think I've done a lot of those. I don't know. I don't really rewatch my episodes. I don't. <gasps> oh my gosh! It's a diamond! Oh. <laughs> I thought I was gonna destroy my source block of water, but nope. I got the lucky. So, when I used to play RuneScape. Yeah, it's another RuneScape story. Yay! And. The only reason why I thought of this story was because I'm still actually subscribed to a few um, RuneScape um, content creators on YouTube, uh, which is weird because I haven't really played that game seriously in, in probably four or five years now at this point. Holy crap, is it really that long? I almost feel like I don't want to get these diamonds <laughs> just because I don't have fortune. It's almost like I should have like grinded for a fortune iron pick before I came here, but whatever. <laughs> this is the life I lead. Oh. No diamond achievement. What the balls? Oh. Did I get it? Oh, I was going to say, I, for, for a second there, I freaked out. I was like, wait, is my inventory full? But alas, it is not. All right. Hey, wow. There's a lot of freaking stuff in here. Now let's be safer here. So. Yeah, the RuneScape video I saw recently was of this guy. Ooh, <laughs> this guy who uh, used to be in a clan, and uh, there was there's like there's, I think he said there was like forty members in there or something like that. And there was this one girl, and they started talking a lot because they were both training the same skill, and then they were in the same place since they had like a home world where they all you know kind of hung out on. And that reminded me, I also had a similar story. Oh, I actually, I should finish this story first. But anyways, he started talking to this girl, and oddly enough, like, he didn't t start talking to her with the intention of, like, flirting with her or whatever, but oddly enough, he started liking her. And, um, they ended up quote-unquote dating. And then he got really clingy. And then they broke up. And that's the end of that story. <laughs> and then a few years later, he actually saw a picture of this girl, and then it turned out she was really freaking beautiful. So, that sucks to be that guy. <laughs> but it doesn't suck as bad as my story. So, there was this... Um, th there was this one person on RuneScape I enjoyed talking to. Her name was I Chocolate, And... She, she was probably in the clan I was in for... Well, she was... Okay, I, I, let's back the story up a bit. I used to be a moderator on one of the clan chats in RuneScape for one of the big... Our bigger fan sites. Hashtag humble break. <laughs> um, yeah, and actually, I got promoted at the same time as this girl, I Chocolate, did. And I guess because of that, we kind of bonded on our newbiness. And so we started talking a lot. And just, I think, honestly, because I was like a. I, I don't, don't want to say 12 year old. I don't remember how old I am. But, you know, younger. I want to say 13 to 14 area. But because, like, you know, she was a girl, I was immediately more interested in talking to her. Why do you make no noises? And you're going to throw that crap at me? It's going to be terrible. Oh, crap. She threw it. <laughs> oh, did she just put it away? Did we just, like, take out stuff and put it away? Also, it's so weird. Oh, man. I don't like this at all. Ah! Oh, no. Have they been freaking speedy? Are they speedy creepers? Are wit do witches actively 
buff their mob fellow friends. <laughs> hey, Glowstone. Why are there so many of you guys? But yeah, so I started talking to this girl I chocolate. I oh, good lord, jeez. Why? Oh, there's another one. 11 seconds. Okay, that's not bad. Good lord. Don't look at me. <laughs> Don't look at me, you asshole. Oh, she'd come around the corner and just freaking kill me. Oh, speaking of that. <laughs> she's like instant damage or some crap. I'm dead. Oh, phew. Okay, let's let's calm down a second here. Well, actually, I think that I don't I think this dead ends in a sec. Oh good lord another one Why? What is the reason? Oh, there's 26. Okay, that's fine I can't hit her eh. let's Just go do, do this do this do this eh. Jeez man, I don't even get a noise when I pick up stuff for some reason from her or him Um yeah, so, cutting to the chase here, I started to be interested in this eye chocolate girl. And, um, the thing was, I was pretty interested in her for a while, and I never really made a move, per se. But, I did, like, whenever she logged on, I would intentionally go hang out with her, and I would, like, give her more attention than other clan mates very... Uh, maybe not noticeably. I, I feel like I was very subtle about it, but maybe that just me thinking I was a slick um, late killer <laughs> when I, you know, I wasn't really. But um, about a month later, she came out to be a guy. <laughs> Shocker, right? Uh, but the thing was, I mean, I was freaking positive it wasn't a guy based on the fact that she, or I guess he, to be more specific now, they were, like, a re very respected member of the community for years. And I think it was more of a she just wished to be a girl, and this was her chance to have, like, you know, a different life, I guess, to see what the other side was like. Oh, and, and also, she did come out, or P did. I'm, I'm so used to calling it. Like, whenever I think of him, I just, like, j just her comes to my mind because of that. Uh, of course, uh, he did come out as gay shortly after that, and... Not that I have any issues with that, but I kind of was... It was weird. It was weird, okay? It was just weird. It was like, I was interested in him or her. That's even weird to say. <laughs> I was interested in him that I thought was a her, and then it turned out to be a him, which made everything crazy. And then as soon as I realized that, I was like, you know what? I don't think I'm actually interested in you. I think it was more of the fact you were one of the seven girls that play this game. And then you weren't a girl. And then it was sad times. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. That's my love life right there. <laughs> one time I dated a girl for seven months. And then she told me she was actually a guy. Just I just made that up on the spot. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, so that, that's my RuneScape story of the day. I don't, I'm pretty sure I haven't told that one before. And I'm really glad that guy, that content creator posted that video of him talking about that. Because it reminded me of that. And I completely forgot that was an event that happened in my life. And I was pretty traumatized. <laughs> yeah, well, I wasn't really traumatized. It was, just, it was just weird. I don't even really remember what I thought. But it was just it's so weird to me that someone could just fake their life like that. Oh, there, that is thunder. Someone could just fake their life like that for years at a time. It's so strange. So strange. I'm really cold all of a sudden. Like, holy crap. It feels like someone just freaking let a blizzard into the house. I'm shaking. I'm like, holy crap, I got goosebumps. Why am I so cold all of a sudden? Am I sick or some crap? You must die, creeper. No, I said you must die, creeper. Alright, well. See Matt and Randy are chatting each other up here. Maybe, maybe Matt thinks Randy's a girl. <laughs> You'll be sorely disappointed in about seven or seven months time. Yeah, sure. Oh, no. Why did you not even react to me, Creeper? <laughs> He's like, why'd you run away from me? I, I'm not causing you any issues. Uh, okay, I'm going to probably call an episode here in a second. What I'll probably do after I end this is continue caving. No, oh, actually, I'm probably not going to do that tonight. I have work in the morning. It's already 11. But, um, I probably shouldn't be doing, going my inventory like this right beside a dark patch. 
Okay, there's probably nothing up there. Um, so yeah. I guess that's really it for today. I'd like to take a moment and thank you guys so very much for watching and liking and subscribing. It means the world to me. Oh. And if you haven't done any of that, do it! I will murder you! It means the world to me if you do it, but if you don't do it, then I will murder you or stuff. <laughs> if you're interested in actually getting onto the server, there's a link down below in the description explaining how to do that. It'll lead you to a video that will tell you all about it, and then maybe you could join our lovely little community. See, there's three of us. There's, there's blue block man, there's bandit red man, and there's blue white duck man. Great. Fantastic community. <laughs> And like 10 other members. But, whoa, I thought I just saw a weird skeleton bow in my face. So, yeah, um, thanks so much for watching. I will talk to you guys later. <coughs> Goodbye.